Good evening, Interworld. Sergeant Slack here from Banana Bomb Productions. Welcoming you back to this episode 71 of my hardcore Minecraft playthrough. In the last episode, uh, I put some filth there to stop me from getting shot by Skleet. Uh, we made this lovely little automatic sugarcane farm, which will go off every time we come in and out of the spawner. And in the meantime, it'll grow up and it'll look lovely. I think I need to recess those is the only thing. Uh, so, without much further ado, in this episode... <sighs> That's really annoying how unlit up that is all over. The Where did you both come from? Yeah. Good shot, I say. Oh, you're joking. Oh, the bleeding girl break old. Sucks and slacks. Hard, hard, hard. Playthrough. Right, so let's beat off some of these skeletons. Maybe with slightly better parlance. Oh, Frigger, I need a, I need a little closey thing so that it only opens when I stand here. I could do with a bleeding piston, can't I? Give me a bleeding piston. Good. And then I'll need some wood to make one of these jobbers. Boosh. And I'm pretty sure it's just as simple as Bosch. No, that's wrong. Uh. Oh, no. Being annoying. Yeah. There's that and that. Oh no, it wants to be inverted. That really doesn't help. I would do if I put something on it though. Alright, but then it's gonna pull that down right where I don't need it to. Anyway, I could do that at another point in time. That's not what we're actually doing today. So get in there, those things. Why have I got a dual stack of iron? Why have I even got iron? Uh, I'll tell you what I do need. Which shall be... Whoop. I need a chest say, the, to put sugar cane in. Hey, yeah. Spiffing. And... Down here, I've almost got full food, so we're not quite there yet. Skeletons still popping them. Stop hitting me! Oh my god. This all needs a slightly better redesign. To make things... Make things better on their way. So... I'm keep a stack of them. Oh, he's got full-on chainmail. Drop me some chainmail. Drop me some chainmail. Come on. Come on. Oh, he did as well. Why did he drop me? He dropped me boots. Protection 2 and feather falling 2 on chainmail boots. That is actually really useful. <coughs> actually really useful. Good. So we're going to pop outside. Uh, yep, we've got wheat with us. So that's good. Oh, and there's a slime out by our steppy stones. At least I should be alright for slime here. I do need to eat something as it's getting dark. Oh, look, it's a big slime with a load of little slimes. Yeah. Oh, look at them all. They're too cute to be murdering this much. Oh. Well. Unfortunately, I'm going to have to murder you, because otherwise you're going to come and kill me when I'm not paying attention. And that is no good. Look at them all, the little... No. Slime. Who'd have it? So I need to decide what I'm going to do down here with my bleeding cows. Where am I going to put all you guys? Why did I jump in the hole? Why did I jump in the hole? Oop. Need to make some ladders for getting in and out of there easier. 
And uh, there's a hole down here, is there? Well, that'll be where I heard the whoa. That'll be where I heard those skeletons the other time around. Should make sense. Spider spawning. I've got some cows, cows up on ledges. Mm. And then not much else going on around here. Let's take out some skeletons, man. Skeletons. I mean spiders, of course. Yeah, ooh, two of you. Don't like having two of you. No. Trying to work on not taking as much damage as possible because after watching Ultra Hardcore, I really did enjoy that. Yeah, swap you out with that. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? There he is. Yeah. Oh, that was good. Power two, punch two, obviously quite useful. That's really annoying how unlit up that is all over. The Where did you both come from? Luckily, I could put you down. I also saw, uh, as Etho showed me, just how useful a bow is in fighting, and it's not something that I use too often. So, could do with having all this area lit up, really. I can't be bothered pillaring up just to fix lighting glitches. All I'm supposed to be doing is sort of fixing out my cows. I missed. Yeah, much better. Sweet. Getting to grips with the bow. And good that you can pick up returned arrows on oh, the ones on the floor. Let's see if I can tempt two cows back. Uh, this would be quite a good place for a cow corral, actually, wouldn't it? I could have all my cows just living free in here. Oh, stop moving. Yeah. Take that. So that would be good, and then it means I don't have to um, freaking bring all these over. Because they'll already be there. Where did that. Where did that creeper die? Did you not drop any loot? How disappointing. Oh, there's some bleeding XP down there. Yep. Stay away. Mm, where are you going? You're quite good training, actually, Creeper. Yeah. Bow fights. Yeah. XP and up again. Stay back. Stay away. You will not be doing damage to me today. Spiffing. Biffing the good league sense. So I'm gonna need. Whoa! <laughs> I do not like the look of that. I was about to say, I'm gonna need some stuff to make a fence out of. I fancy having a netherrack fence. Although, maybe I can upgrade to a, a netherrack fence at some point later in the game. Ooh, gotta kill the skelly first. Oh, I got even close to me. I mean, the best way to keep things from being able to hit you is to get uh, just to keep them away from you. I don't even need to use my sword on you guys, do I? I also discovered the other day that you can freaking you can enchant sticks with books. So if you get if you want to have, like, um, what's the thing called? Silk Touch. 
you want to have silk touch on something, then the best way to do it is, well, not the best way, but one way to do it is to put it on a stick, because sticks don't take damage. And it's much easier that way. Right, we could do with a bit of daytime, so we're going to have to create some fence. So we're going to wander off into the swamp and hack down some trees, unless I happen to have a buttload of the stuff already. Wow, that's a noise. That is a noise. So, slime balls. Go, a good area for slime balls, it would seem. <laughs> I have axe on me. Have axe, will travel. I should swap axe with shovel, really, because I'm not going to use both together. That's almost about to die as well. Did I bring diamonds? Uh, it'd be over here, wouldn't it? Uh, books and thing. Uh, no, no, I didn't. I could do with going for an explore, though, and sorting me out some diamonds. Right. Uh, wood. Have I got masses? I don't have masses. But I might have enough. Let's use the jungle wood and that and the ladders I wanted to bring with me. I'm not even putting it in my inventory. What are you playing at, Slack? Awful. No. Yes. Good. So, uh, I don't know what I make fences. I oh, know, I know what I can do. I can make a cobblestone fence. Yeah, let's do that. I never do that. Okay, so wood. Wood. Don't need you. Splendid. Cobblestone. Six. I do need you. One. A two. A two. A four. A five. There it is. Bosh. Wow, that's a lot of that stuff. Well, good. Oh, I'm planning on using a lot of it, so. Shut up, you noisy buggers. Still hitting me from in there. I'm still not particularly a fan of. Um. You cook that up. You take that stuff. Which nobody needs. I will need an awful lot of torches. Though I might use something else other than torches. So I think it's time that we braved it up. And went to the nether shortly. It's a little better during the day. So annoying. So where was it up to? Don't, no, it wasn't there, was it? Must have been at least like that. If not, like more, more like other things. Mm, that's good. Everyone dying off. Yeah. So if we want to make this our cow corral. We can just start over here. And wall the buggers in. Really? No, oh, we got up to. It's always good to have a look around first. Um, yeah, I think we'll do it along the top of this hill, like Bosh. over here don't do a great deal of building in this world it is something I should do more of hey cow come on come and uh, come and chew on this tasty wheat Ooh. yeah and you too you wanna you wanna yeah go for it Take it all the way up to the end. I 
don't know if I like that, but I'll leave it until I've finished everything. Because it's easy enough to fix, and that could make a good way in. No! Curses. I can't eat wheat. Not in its raw form, anyway. That's one stack down. That's cobblestone stack. So, where's this going to come over to? Oh, nice here ish. Why is it going to make its way over to there? And go over there? Yes. Well easily. That's better. Now if I was a cow, I would be up here and I'd just walk over that. It's not what we want. Again, cow can just walk over there. Better. A little bit secure from that end. Still kind of... But I um, don't think any of our cows are going to be that dexterous. Uh, what about... No, that's all covered nicely. And yeah, the only thing is, as you have mentioned, could well be going over there. Cool, so that's that done. We're gonna have a good way in. What happens if I, oh, it does do that so I can have it. Yeah, nice, like it. Yeah. Pff, good shot, I say. So I wanna have a way in, way out. There's no stone doors, is there? Hmm. I guess I'm going to have to go with a freaking gate. Fence gate and not a button. Why did I make a button? A pressure plate. I wanted a pressure plate, not a button. Fence gate. I don't really need a button, but since I made one, Oh, there's nowhere to put it. Ha ha! I'll put it there. Um, oh, it's probably not the best idea to have one of those. Because now it means other things can walk in and nobble me cows. Which is not what I want them to be doing. It just doesn't look secure, but it is. Pretty sure it is. All that back ones. Continue the theme, all the back ones. There's loads of them around here. Bleeding loud. Yep. Pick you up, and then I have a large fenced in area for my cows. I don't think they can get too far away, but you never know. Oop. Make some lighting up happen. Might as well use up the torches I've got on me. Hopefully try and reduce spawns a little, which is only going to help with the monster spawner. Forcing things to spawn over that way. I do need a better solution for lights though, other than just pounding torches in everywhere. Yeah, there we go. Fixed you at least. Right, so let's... I'll tell you what we should probably do. Probably bring in the other cows before we start breeding them. So, 
let's move our cows over. I was torn between having an inside and an outside, and I've pretty much decided on the outside, as you can see. I like the long grass. Want it over here. Want your seeds. Don't want any of that. Well, maybe I'll build them a nice little hut at some point as well. Come on then. Oh, bleeding rain as well. Straight off. Come on. Come on, you cowsy bastards. Oh, they're going to be really difficult to get through that gate, aren't they? Luckily, I can just do this. No, come on, come back, come on, come on. You, if I make your amorous, you're going to have to follow me to get to the other end of your amorous situation. Come on. Oh, we've got some slime in the way as well. Spiffing. Yeah, you, you look freaky when you're above me. You look well freaky. Not a fan of it. Truth be told. Come on. Come on. In you get. Good. Can't help but notice that slime, of course, do a much better job at this than other things. Get in. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry, slime, but you're complicating matters. Come on, you filthy buggers. Come and get in your new home. Multiple moves. Multiple moves. Come on then. Follow me up this hill while I have a cup of tea. Mm. Don't look at me like that. It's weak. Come on. One of the little ones got out. One of the big ones got out as well. Oh, come on. Can you not see this wheat? There we go. Notice the slimes didn't have this much of a trouble following me. It's just the cows. Cows, they do it on purpose. No. They are deceptive. Maybe it's because I'm waving steak about them. In between times. Come on, wheat, wheaty wheaties. Come on, you two. Let's get into the corral. Oh, yeah. Did I miss one? I think it might be all of it, actually. Certainly as much as I can be bothered with. Oh, well, there we go then. Breed you guys up. Plenty of cows in here soon enough. Why is that one cow got like three babies? Why is it so lit up at the front and not the back? But it's going to be a nightmare at this rate. So I need a little bit more. Have I got sticks on me? I've got sticks on me. I might as well just go and take that coal out of the wall. As I'm going to need to at some point anyway. All good. Yeah, arrows, slack. Arrows, good plan. Good freaking plan. At least I can see what I'm lighting up now. Oh, sweet. Hidden lighting. Which is better. <laughs> But it does require a hell of a lot more work. Mm. 
Not now, chaps. I'm lighting things up. It's not there. Yeah. Oh, pants! I somehow managed to survive that quite well. Build it up a bit, though. It was nothing like that. Let me all just take a bit off, and then you won't notice. A ton of grass is growing over. You won't notice that that was a creeper hole. Freaking creepers! One of you down. Mm, that's pretty good. They're all kind of nicely lit up. Maybe I'll make a pond in the middle here. Yeah, let's do that. This area does need some lighting up, though. Yeah. Mm hmm. Whoa! Freaking end, dude, of scariness. Oh, you're joking. Oh, is it bleeding girl break old? Well, it's a good job I found the girt big hole in my corral. Otherwise, that might have been embarrassing. In fact, that definitely would have been embarrassing. I'd come back one day and just, all my cows have wandered off. I've been breeding like a demon. Not that I've been breeding like a demon yet. But that was the plan. Good. So, cows, we have a plenty. Oh, that must be all the cow uh, stuff. I need water is what I need, isn't it? That's a skelly. Stay back, creep door. <laughs> I'm quite liking this bow, I have to admit. Boat. Should use these to make me a little parkour way out like I've got over there. Oh, let's not forget. Let us not forget. Now, hope you guys appreciate me uh, making you a pond here. I'm sure you won't, because, well, you're cows. Did that already... It did? Cool. I haven't worked out new flow mechanics yet, but... That only seems to be pretty good. So it's good to have a pond, you've got to look after your animals, and this is why I never get anything done in games because I spend ages making my cows a pond when it's freaking raining and they don't even need a smegging pond. But, you know, sometimes you've got to be nice. And you've got to give your cows a pond. It's good slack water. Everywhere apart from that. Yep. There you go, cows. Have a pond. You love it. You love it. I'm just going to fill up this whole area with cows if I can. That is my idea. 
What have you got to? There you go. So then I'll have plenty of leather right at the spawner where I need it for uh, books, books and such. And of course, there'll be plenty of beef for the Eatons. Only eating. No, Lister, eating's when the food goes in your mouth. Hello, zombie villager, eh? Can you hit me over a fence? No. Ah, yeah, no carrots. No carrots. Alright, I have two bits of wheat left. Who's going to be the lucky? Don't shoot my cows. Am I out of arrows? I'm out of arrows. Who's going to be lucky too? It's going to be you two. You can filth it up again. Try and get him to shoot. Nice. Nice. I don't know what the minecrackers are worried about with all this bleeding. Oh, they're so, so difficult skeletons. Yeah. Get away. Oh, don't blow up my bleeding stuff. You gert numptification of a creeper, you. Oh. Gotta try and make this look natural. Alright, hillside act natural. Oh well, there you go. Natural as folk like. you there and then yeah na natural as book hellside nothing untoward happened there. i should learn not to do things at night really well we'd probably best call that a day there guys uh, i'm thinking we need to go to the nether soon but i want to finish work here on my spawner which means making the outside look pretty i believe that's next up on my list of things to do I really must fix that so that it doesn't do that either Ah, uh, there we go. Uh, so, this is Sergeant Slack from Banana Bun Productions saying thanks very much for watching this. Episode 71, oh, four at once, of my hardcore Minecraft playthrough. Uh, comment, like, subscribe if you did, and I'll catch you next time. Ta-ra!